Everyone is using AI note takers these days, and for good reason. They save you a bunch of time, and they make sure you and everybody else follow up on all the action items for a meeting. And there's tons of them out there, from Otter to Fathom to Circleback to Fireflies. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can build your own for free in just a few minutes using Real.app, Google Drive, and the Claude Anthropic console and you might want to do this for a couple reasons one you want to you might want to save some money so you're not paying an extra 20 bucks a month for something that just transcribes notes in a way that you could do by yourself for free in the way i'm going to show you now and number two you may want to customize the way the notes and the workflow appear in a way that other tools don't let you do so with that let's dive in first i'll show you the setup the key here is we're going to use Google Drive's native meeting recording feature, which is included for free in your Google Workspace plan. And the way that works is it gives you a folder in Google Drive called Meet Recordings that includes the complete video of the completed meeting. And if you check the right box, it'll also include a raw text transcript. Now this raw tr text transcript probably isn't as good as the ones provided by those AI note takers, but I'm gonna show you how we can use AI thanks to Claude, to turn that into a great set of meeting notes, meeting notes. So this is the first thing you're gonna need, your Google Drive Meet Recordings folder. The second thing you're gonna need to do is to create a template of what you want your meeting notes to look like. And in this case, I'm gonna create a really simple template which has the title, date, and the attendees of the meeting. It's gonna have a summary section at the top, then an action item section, and then a detailed note section. And you can do whatever you want, um, depending on your role or your type of business to create the meeting notes template that you want. Now, now that I have this set up in place, I'm gonna create a related app workflow that detects whenever a new transcript is added to that meet recordings folder, it's gonna then automatically use AI to create a meeting notes output that maps to this format and then it's gonna write it into a new Google Doc. Uh, let me show you how to do that. So first in Real Edit App, the trigger we're gonna use is file added to folder. And the parent folder that we're gonna look for is meet recordings. There you go. And you can just double check that the files match what you expect to be there. And indeed I see these, that the recording and transcript from my meeting with Avi. and what you're gonna get as output is the file. Next, I'm gonna add a path to make sure I'm only working with the transcript and not the raw recording. Uh, we may wanna do something else with the raw recording later, but in this case, we'll just work with the transcript. And to do that, I'm gonna make sure that the file title contains transcript, and then the other path I'm gonna have raw recording. And we're going to leave that path empty for now. We're just going to end the run. Um, but in the future, we could totally do something with, with that other path. Now it's time to put in our AI step that's going to take in the raw transcript and output it in the notes format that we want. And to do that, I'm going to use an AI step in Reload App. It's going to be a custom prompt step. Now I am not a prompt engineering expert by any means. But I wanna show you how to use a really cool tool from Anthropic that's gonna enable me to generate a high quality prompt for this use case. I'm gonna go over to the Anthropic console, which is at console.anthropic.com, and I'm gonna generate a prompt. So my task is given a complete transcript of a meeting, please generate a detailed but concise summary that includes the following elements. And then I can just copy the elements I want from my template. You can see I'm just keeping the, the placeholder text that related app is gonna be able to replace later. And now I'm gonna let Anthropic generate this prompt for me. What you can see Anthropic doing here, it's quite smart, 
it's telling me, it's giving the AI some more information about how to write a good summary using clear language, using bullet, lights, bullet points when appropriate, keeping sentences and paragraphs concise. And it also is gonna tell um, Anthropic, uh, excuse me, it's gonna tell the AI how to format the output as effectively as possible and give it an example. So now I'm gonna continue. And this is, this is pretty cool. What you can actually do here is you can then test it out with a bunch of examples. But for now, I'm gonna trust Anthropic and I'm just gonna copy this directly into relay.app. And I'm gonna fill in my prompt field. And there's a couple things that I'm gonna to need to do to make this work in relay.app. For example, in Anthropic, they pass in variables with this double curly brace UI. I don't actually need that because in relay, we have this really easy to use attach data UI where I can just attach the, the contents of the, the file. One key of using AI steps in relay.app is that we want structured output, output that we can pass into a subsequent automation. In this case, we need these specific fields that we're gonna be able to pass into the new notes document that we create. And we have a handy feature here that based on the prompt, will automatically generate what structured output we think you're gonna need. Let's see how that works with this anthropic prompt. And you can see here that it produces the date, the title, the summary, the notes, the list of attendees and the list of action items, which is exactly what we're gonna need later on when we're writing into a Google Doc. And so now that I have this AI prompt created, which is gonna take in the transcript and it's gonna output all this structured information, I can write that information into a new Google Doc. And for that, I'm gonna use the Google Docs copy doc and fill in placeholders. The document I'm gonna copy is that meeting notes template I just showed you. The title of the copy document is gonna be notes. And then I'm gonna use uh, some information from my AI output, which is the title and the date of the meeting. I can even change in line how I wanna format the date. Maybe I wanna format it like this. And I'm gonna put the, these meeting notes in the same folder as the original meeting notes template, which is just my meeting notes form, uh, folder. Then I'm gonna replace each of the placeholders in that Google Doc with the AI output. So first, I'm gonna replace <coughs> the title with the title from the AI output. Then I'm gonna replace the date with the date from the AI output. I'm gonna replace the list of attendees with the complete list of attendees from the AI output. I'm gonna replace the summary with the summary. I'm gonna replace the action items with the list of action items. And then I'm gonna replace the notes with the notes. So now in just a few minutes, I've created my own AI note taker using tools that I have for free. It uses Google Drive to get the raw transcript of the meeting. I used the Anthropic prompt generator to create a really good prompt that fits that transcripts notes into my meeting notes template. And I built that all into a related app workflow that will automatically create a document with the right placeholders filled in. Now let me show you the whole thing in action for a real meeting that I had. And so I showed you before that I had that transcript of my meeting with Avi uh, a little while ago, and now I'm gonna create a test run to show my AI note taker in action for that meeting. <clears throat> you can see that we detected that it was indeed a transcript. And now we're calling GPT-40 mini, which is the model I selected to create my summarized notes. And you could very easily switch from GPT-40 mini to GPT-40 to one of the Anthropic Claude models or one of the Gemini models. And typically, I just checked the transcript, it's like a 26 page document. So typically the AI will take several seconds to uh, figure out how to pull out the right information that I need for my notes. Okay, the AI has created my summary and let me go to the new document it's created. So you can see here, it created a title, Meeting on Automation and Meeting Management. It got the date right. 
It uh, got the attendees, myself and Avi. It gave a summary focused on improving the automation of event management, specifically how to handle scheduling meeting invites and associated workflows in Airtable, actually pretty accurate. <laughs> and we talked about an overview of current challenges, uh, proposed modifications, and presented some data and feedback from outreach efforts with prospective leads. Avi's gonna implement the changes. I'm gonna follow up on the feedback. And then it looks like the detailed notes are are pretty thin. So what, what I'd want to do now is go back to my prompt and update the detailed notes section of the prompt to give a much more comprehensive view of what happened in the meeting. But this is how in just about 10 minutes, I was able to set up my own AI note taker completely for free using tools that I already have, which include Google Drive, uh, related app, and then I use the Anthropic prompt generator to generate my prompt. And then I use GPT-40 Mini as the model to do the automatic note taking for me. Uh, give it a try, let me know what you find. And if you have any tips for creating better prompts or creating a template you really like for, for notes, please add that in the comments below.